Hi, I am Namita Piparaya and welcome to Yoga Nama. Today is the last and final class of Power of Breath and I sincerely hope that you enjoyed this practice and I would love to hear from you so please do let me know in comments your feedback or whatever your thoughts are, how your experience was and you can also find me on Instagram as Yoga Nama and have a chat with me there. So let's begin with today's practice, an important practice. In this we are going to employ visualization practice. What does that mean? You will know as you practice along with me because for this class I am not going to give you instructions before the practice. Instead, I am going to guide you through the practice as you do it. So as always, find a meditative position of your choice, a mudra of your choice. Close your eyes and take those few moments to start connecting with the breath. Just observing the process of inhalation and exhalation. Nice deep breaths, trying to find full lung expansion. Every time you inhale in all four directions, your two sides, the front of the chest and the back. Especially the backs of your lungs. We often ignore that area. So remind yourself to breathe into the front of the lungs as well as back of the lungs every time you breathe. Gradually with practice over time. This will get easier, your breath will get deeper. You just have to be patient with it. Today, we are going to add a color to our breath, a white light. Let this breath be a beautiful, pristine, bright white light. As you breathe this white light in through your nostrils, it fills up your lungs, providing fresh energy in, circulating through your lungs, cleansing and detoxing. And as you exhale, this used up version of the breath leaves your body and disperses into the environment. Inhale, breathe in this beautiful white light, filling up your lungs like two balloons, circulating through the lungs and as you exhale, the used up air leaves the body having done its job and merges into the environment. Inhaling this beautiful white light into your lungs. And now hold it there for just a few counts, allowing it to circulate there a little more, going into the corners of the lungs that are hard to reach. And then exhale and let go of the breath entirely. Maybe it's slightly grey in colour because it's done some cleansing now. And let it all out. Inhale, breathe in white light. That is your breath. Hold it in. Let it do its job. Let it go through the lungs, cleansing the various parts that are hard to reach. And exhale, let this slightly dull grey light leave your body. Eliminating the toxins and the thoughts that you don't need anymore. Let's continue like this. Inhaling beautiful white light goes into the lungs. Cleanses your system. Hold the breath in as long as you can. And then exhale, push this air out. Emptying it out, trying to create more space for fresh energy, fresh white light to come in. Inhale, breathe in. Your lungs are full of this beautiful white light. Hold your breath in. It's doing its job. It's circulating, cleaning. And as you exhale, empty out this used up air that is of no use to you anymore. Squeezing the navel to the spine as you empty out the breath. Inhale, white light into your lungs. 
and hold it in and exhale let it all out now you know the practice continue like this with me for your next breath try to breathe into the backs of the lungs the area that we don't access that often let the nice bright white light push into the backs of the lungs now you can feel it in your thoracic spine hold that breath let it erode all the unnecessary bits that have been stuck there and as you exhale let it out all those unnecessary bits leaving you for good let's do two more breaths into the backs of the lungs inhale breathing into the back pushing the lungs into the spine hold that in there and exhale release one more time inhaling into the backs of the lungs hold your breath and exhale Inhale, release everything that's of no use, getting cleaned up and released. Just like this, you will now continue inhaling into your lungs this beautiful white light that is powerful, that's electric, that's going to do a lot of cleansing as you hold the breath in into your lungs. And then as you exhale, you release that energy, emptying out the lungs till you breathe in that white electric light that is your breath again. I want you to let your intuition guide you today. Breathe into those areas of the lungs that this practice is pushing you towards. Maybe it's the front or the back or the side or whatever feels good to you. Maybe it's the uppermost lobes. Maybe you're being driven towards belly breathing. I want you to explore that. This is your practice. You know your body better than anyone else. And this is your time to listen to yourself, to your subconscious, to your inner intuitive intelligence. And breathe that way. Just remember every breath in is that beautiful divine white light going into the body into your lungs and as you exhale you release that used up energy of a slightly dull color because it's done a lot of work in your body like that continue Visualization is a very powerful practice, so don't underestimate it. There is no religious angle to it. There is no superstition to it. Visualization works. Because that's the power of your mind, of your brain. If we visualize something, more often than not, we can also manifest it in our life. And these are the times where we need to give special attention to our lungs to make them stronger, to make them more powerful. And that's exactly what we are doing through this practice today. The world is going through a lot right now. We are going through a lot right now. And the only thing we can do is make sure we are protected, we are safe. Others around us are safe. And do our best that we can to keep ourselves in the best of health. With that intention in mind, just take two more breaths. I will guide you through them. Inhaling that beautiful white light into your lungs. 
holding it in. Exhaling that new step energy, letting it all out, drawing your navel to the spine. One more time, inhale this beautiful electric energy into your lungs. Hold it in. And then exhale it all out with a sense of gratitude for all the work that it's done for you today. Let it go. Take a few normal breaths. Observe how you feel, how your lungs feel, how your breath feels. Observe any heating or cooling sensation you may feel around your chest. Maybe you can breathe a little better. Maybe you feel more relaxed and more confident. Maybe you have more energy. You definitely should have more energy right now. And as we end this session and this series, I again want to remind you that remember that you are empowered through yoga and pranayam practices. Both help you take charge of your health in a holistic way, in a very complete way. So make time for them. Make time for your yoga practice, your asana practice, and also make time for your pranayam practice. They will guide you through life, no matter if things are normal or abnormal. It's going to sustain you mentally and physically. Yoga is empowering. Yoga is healing. And yoga is rejuvenating as well. Have faith in the practice. Have faith in your breath. And on that note, on an exhale, bring your chin to chest. Open your eyes with a few gentle blinks. And on an inhale, look up. And exhale, release and relax the body. Thank you so much for joining me in this series. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I have enjoyed making them. Just by virtue of taking these classes, I have felt more relaxed and that's been a realization for me. That not just doing the practices, but mentally going through them while I'm giving instructions is also quite powerful. So it just reinforces my faith in our breath and in the visualization practice of yoga and pranayam. I would love to hear from you, like I said in the beginning of the class. So please do reach out to me and I will see you again in another series. Thank you and take care of yourself.